Do you think there might have been some tactic here to allow that to go on, knowing that controlling Alec Murdoch was going to be difficult because he clearly is a guy who enjoys and has, I think, fair to say, the gift of gab, but also that he might hang himself. You give him a little rope, he might end up saying something. And to a degree, I have to say, after a while, he started to come across, and you mentioned it, as a huckster, a guy who was really skilled at figuring out ways to parse words and, and twist things in his favor when it really didn't come across genuine, except when he was talking about his family. That's right, Michael. I heard you all earlier in the show a couple of hours ago talk about this, and I, I, I agreed with you that if we're going to give Creighton Waters um, some credit here, it's perhaps a strategy of his to let this person hang himself. I think we saw that in the Robert Durst second trial, which mm -hmm. didn't work out for Robert Durst as well, which we referenced earlier in the show. However, the only way that that theory works for cross-examination, Michael, as we all know, is when you can stop the narrative and begin to impeach the witness with the objectively verifiable documents, of which there are many. Where are your clothes? Let's pull up the exhibit that shows the picture of you, sir, with the clothing um, and the fruit tree. You did not produce that shirt to the authorities. In the 20 weeks of this case, you have never once produced those that, that clothing item. You never went to the police and told them, I've been telling a lie. You never raised your hand in the middle of this testimony today and said, I've been telling a lie all along. It's it's these types of moments that we're waiting for. It's the one-two punch. If you're going to set him up and allow him to talk, you got to come with the, with the cross later and really try to pin him down on his lies as the second part of that act. And because that didn't happen, we were all left hanging as a country, as a chat, <laughs> um, and that's the problem with this cross. I'm hoping they open the door for a recross, Michael. I'm hoping and praying there's some sort of new fact. Yeah, we'll have to see, but I agree 100%. I think fair enough that, that we were looking for something. Uh, I think we were all looking for something, and it didn't quite get there. There were moments, but I'm not sure it quite got there. I, I, one can only wonder if it lost in the case. A lot of people seem to think so. All right, stand by. I do have to take a break. Alec Murray.